Hey y'all, happy Monday. It is a gorgeous day and it is of course Make My Mantle Monday. And by popular demand, we are doing our bee mantle today. So it's super cute, whites and yellows, very, very summery. I'm gonna zoom in on each picture and show it to you. Some you've seen before, a couple of them are new, and some of them are some new takes on some things that we've already done. So you've seen the Home Sweet Home before, it just really went well with the bee theme, and so we used that down on the hearth, along with our queen bee set that we did a couple weeks ago in the shop. And of course, there's the gorgeous tiered tray set for the bees. Look at that cutie. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. So we're going to move up to the mantle to my favorite one. The be happy sign is just so stinking cute. I love the honeycomb. I love how bright and happy that is. And of course, one of our customers gave us that adorable little bee gnome. So we, we always try to sit him in somewhere because he's just adorable. Now this is a new set. This is the trio set. This is the home sweet home, the hay honey, and the bee. These are a big version, at least nine inches of the tiered tray set. These were the three pieces that you guys liked the most. And of course, there are our Be Kind tags. Those go way back, but if you're interested in a set of those, I can cut you a set of those as well. And then this one is brand new. This is our Be Happy frame sign, and I love this one. I love that bee for some reason. It's just a really cute sign. And then of course, Welcome to Our Hive, which is always a favorite with you guys. Every, I think everybody in town has made that sign. <laughs> So there'll be links for these projects so that you guys can get those if you haven't gotten those. And just a really quick reminder, just like I do every week, you'll see a lot of the same elements on the mantle because again, you're just taking down your seasonal pieces and adding different pieces to them. So make sure that you have something glass, something wood, something metal, I think, and then in something soft. I think that if you keep those elements in your mantle, you cannot go wrong. So a lot of things I leave and then I just add to it. So you don't have to make it complicated. It doesn't have to be a long process. It takes me about 10 minutes to take down the old mantle and about 10 minutes to design a new one. So it's not a long process, but it is super fun and it really makes the room if you change your mantle out frequently. So have fun with it. Use your mantle as a palette and really enjoy yourself. It is a welcoming space in your home and it should be fun. So enjoy it and have a great night, guys. Bye.